Hello everyone, you know some footballers enjoy a rainy day, not sure fans always feel that way, but an exciting match in prospect nonetheless. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner as always is Stuart Robson and very much looking forward to bringing you live action from the Bundesliga in a matter of moments. It's St Pauli up against Hoffenheim. Well thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Oh, a fine block. This is how it looks for the home side. Nevin Kurzawa plays with Shime Versalco in the fullback positions. Julian Draxler plays with Toni Kroos in the centre of midfield. And as for the attack, well, it has a bold look about it with three forwards listed from the beginning. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, Derek, this season, he's been outstanding on occasions. His goal tally is really, really good. He looks a threat whenever he gets the ball, and his movement's been excellent. I'm sure he'll add to his tally today, and they're going to have to mark him really tightly. Well, they couldn't keep it. Well, visionary passing. It's still alive. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Well, you have to think they're going to take the lead at some point. Because they're really looking dangerous at the moment. Less than convincing defending. It might be on for them. The keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there. And the play having stopped, a chance for the referee to go back and hand out the caution. That's a useful cross. Right, I think we'd better go over to Alex Scott because I'm hearing there's been a goal in the Bielefeld game. Alex. Yes, it's a goal for Borussia Dortmund. It was a low-driven cross, and he was never going to miss from there. They've scored the opener with 18 minutes on the clock. Thanks for the update, Alex. Vasaiko. Excellent passing. Well, flinging himself at the ball. Now, how about the short corner? Shot attempted. Well, able to close down the shot. Draxler. And a it certainly wasn't a clean tackle. And the referee has got to book him, I think. And yellow it is. A booking. Yeah, he was too impatient to win the ball and probably deserved a yellow card. Understandably, he wanted to give it a go, but straight at the keeper. Jim City. Another perfect position to read it. Well, the hosts have dominated the flow of the game in the last 15 minutes and have played some really lovely football going forward. But they must now make it count and get themselves in front. Chance to do damage. But quick thinking defensively. Well, for St. Pauli, a very good victory in the last game against Union Berlin. How do you think this one will go, Stuart? Well, to go away from home and win was a good result for them in a really entertaining game. And today, I think they will continue that sort of form. They're good defensively, and I reckon they'll get another victory. Niklas Stark. Better at Jim CC now. Sunset. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. The goal to put them in front! And there's a turn-up for the books based on what we've seen in this game so far. 
Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. 1-0 then. Patient build-up at the moment. This could level it. And it is the equaliser. Parity now. And who's to say what's going to happen next? Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. So back underway following the equaliser. Tony Kroos. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. And the pass, a good one. Fevre. And so it is, the first half story has been... It might be... Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Fevre. Sunset. He has time to play it over. Geiger. A really top notch piece of defending. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. This is looking threatening. Crossing possibilities. Fevre, dangerous ball. Not really the ideal clearance. Well, no damage done. Well, this is the home of live football, and we have more action from the Bundesliga coming up here on EA TV. It's Hoffenheim taking on Bayer Leverkusen. Draxler. Well read to ease the pressure. And into the last 30 minutes now. Kurzawa. Toruna Riga. Happy just to retain the ball in their own half and draw out the opposition. Now, from what I'm hearing, there's been a goal in the Bayern Munich game. Over to Alex for the information. It's a goal for Wolfsburg. It's now 1-0 with 64 minutes played. Many thanks, Alex. Fevre. And can they make one of these passes count? And the cross is very much on. Teammate in support. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Can they get in behind them? Machis. Better at Jim Cece now. It's opening up for them. Really important piece of last ditch defending. Plenty of forward momentum here. 
but can they produce? Not the best challenge, free kick. Well, he knows he's on his last warning after that one. Well, I don't think it warranted a yellow card. He made a genuine attempt to play the ball there. Well, not enough subtlety about that free kick, I'm afraid. Well, the stats tell you everything. They've lacked invention, they've lacked creativity, and they haven't got the ball into the penalty area often enough. And that's why they're behind in this game. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Niklas Stark. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. Brun Larsen. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw-in. Unable to trouble the defence with that cross. Versalco. Timo Hubers. Well, it must be mighty annoying when you can't get near the ball. Tony Kors. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. Terrific block. If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. And the short option preferred. Gives it a go! Five minutes left. Sunset. They're showing a willingness to attack, as they must, given the circumstances. Time running out. Draxler. Now with Toruna Riga. Kurzawa. Camara. Fruitful looking attack. Vasaiko. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Roberts. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be... It might be on for them.